super special shout out to all my tier 3 members and patrons, Riptide, Anik D, Zee Wanderer, Matthew Wall, Charlene Kelly, and Yushika Bay for their amazing support. Hey guys, and welcome back to Simulus and I, Darkness Falls mod. So, I want to show you guys this before I go into the base. As you guys can see, there's a turret over here, and there's actually one on every corner. There's one there, one there on the floor, and one on the other side. Now, I did this because we are getting screamers over here as well. Uh, wait, where did I put the entrance again? I put the entrance over here somewhere, but I can't forget. Uh, I can't remember which side. But yeah, basically, we have turrets all the way around this place. Oh, this side. Uh, turrets all the way around this place, and that's just to make sure that when screamers show, because we're busy smelting right now, we don't have to worry too much about what they do. Because at the moment, if a screamer gets in somewhere, also, I've blocked off all the windows, so they can't just pop in and out. But if they start waiting on the walls of here, at least that will destroy it. I also went and I took this rooftop off because I'm going to make my farm here. I don't want to do it underground. Uh, well, I could do it underground. But I want to play a place, for, for example, rain catches or stuff like that. I want to try new things. Or I could just make the iron um, pipelines, the irrigation pipelines, and put them on the roof. And then I don't have to worry about the water depleting after a while. Also, what I want to do, I went and I arranged this whole place. And everything that I arranged, I closed off. So all the doors, oh, I double tap that. All the doors are now closed in these rooms because they're empty. This one I can actually use for something else. If I hear a ton of gunfire, I know it's a wandering ward. Uh, even here over here, there's nothing there, so I just close that off. As you guys can see, I also went and I destroyed all the cabinets. I want to move all of this to this side. This room just has way more space than this room. Basically, you can actually have workbenches on this side going down and then also on this side going up like this we can have it on the walls uh the storages we can have on this wall over here or even on this wall over here at the back there's so much more space i don't know why i didn't do that from the start because it would have saved me so much time and effort okay now we have a problem with we have so much stuff that we need to drop that i don't know if we're gonna have space for everything that's medical farming i need to make myself i think i'm gonna make instead of I could just make dirt. Wait, let me just do this. There's nothing over here that we still need to make level 80, I think. Most of my guns are level 80. One or two of them, like for example, the uh, SMG are not. So if I get uh, extra SMGs, I can actually go ahead and combine those. But everything else over here, as you guys can see, is already level 80. Uh, sniper rifle is not, so I could drop the sniper rifle perhaps. But everything else, there's no point. I, I just want to keep one of each gun to be able to say, hey, look, I have everything level 80. Uh, now that we know the coil gun is that great, I'm going to start using the coil gun as well. Do that. Uh, melee. Melee, melee. Okay, the club. Okay, we need that club. Nice. Uh, the baseball bat's level 80 already. This one is level 50, so I keep that. And the rest we sell. So I need to, when I'm dropping like this, I need to make sure that I sell only the stuff that I really need to. As you guys can see, we have a ton of casings now. But we're running low on coil batteries, and we only have so many tips left. So I need to go and smelt a ton of tips now, but I was busy with cement and stuff first. Let me just see, can I drop something over here? No. Other mods. And stone. Oh yeah, look at this. A whole chest full of iron. It feels so nice having that much iron. I should have had it from the start though. But yeah guys, look at this. Laser M60. There's a laser shotgun over here somewhere as well. Oh no, I think we could craft it. Oh, I thought we were able to actually go and use it. But yeah, a laser shotgun. If a, if a coil shotgun is that great, how is a laser uh, shotgun going to be? Okay, engines full. Engines full. Building supplies. As you guys see, we have a ton of steel over here now. Clothing. Ooh, we can read this together. Because now we are level... We are way past level 150, guys. Like, way, way past. I want to make sure that we have level 80 of this stuff as well before I go and sell stuff. Uh, but... I am a little bit encumbered right now, so it makes it really exceedingly hard to make space. You know, all those weapons we're going to sell. More gear, that's the stuff we need to run around with. Do this. Do this. No, no, no. See, the workbenches and the boxes mustn't be this close together. It's a pain when they are. Okay, so that's all the weapons and mods. No, clothing and mods. Weapons and mods are supposed to be over here, but even this. We're way too full. Like, way, way too full. I need to go sell stuff as well, but before we do that, we need to repair. And in this mod, repair kits are just way too expensive. Okay, sell. That's ammo. Okay, I haven't even taken stuff off my drone right now. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut away while I put this stuff away and see you guys now. 
Okay, so everything has been put away. I'm actually going to go and put away this as well. That just takes up unnecessary space. This thing, this is basically a replacement for this, except with this you get uh, some wood back, and with this you don't get resources. You just destroy stuff. But, I mean, I don't care. We have resources right now, so now we only have to use two over there. I have an automatic shotgun that I want to test out. Um, I should probably put the mods back on from the coil shotgun. Yeah, I want to also see, what do I need to be able to make myself a, a ton of quill ammo? I'm guessing you need paper and stuff for that as well, right? Basically, yeah, uh, these two weapons mods are completely uh, interchangeable, so that's kind of awesome. Now we're just going to do this. This one has no sell price. We've already mastered it. It sucks. If I were to scrap it... Oh, wait, that gives you 90. I'm going to scrap it. That was the... Uh... Security. I just want to make sure it's security. We have it mastered. Nice. Okay, I'm going to scrap it. We might be able to use it for other stuff, guys. Uh, you might be shouting on the screen. No, why did you do that? But for now, that's okay. Um, I also want to go and check over here. As you guys can see, three out of five. We need to be level 150. Or use. we need to either use five uh, points. Um, or instead of using five points, we just do this. Now it's four out of five. Boom. Seven points for the next one. Once again, we can just make the book. Although, I don't think we have more of those red notes. Do we need four more? So if I can go do... I think I should do uh, Eve's quest again. Which is going to give us a small bunker. And with a small bunker, we should get one, laser tech. And two, we should be able to get ourselves some more um, laser, uh, laser weapons. And we should be able to get ourselves some more notes. Every time we've looted the little bunker by so far, we've gotten like eight or nine notes. We just need four more. As soon as we have those four, we are set. Oh, I need one more. Uh, let me just quickly do this generic. Oh, you can make it. Nice. What do you need? One ink. And blue. Because the reason I say, oh, yes, guys, is ablative. I need requires 30, right? Now it requires 60 per one. Oh, that's expensive. But if I have one more, then we don't have to worry about fire that much. So I wonder, do we have more ink? We have a, a lot more dye, but I don't think we have any ink left. I should probably go and try and sell most of this stuff, because of most of this we're not going to be able to use anyways. Uh, this we have on our chest piece already, right? I want to make sure that we are, um, yeah, we are spiking some zombies while they're hitting us. Okay, so we need to make sure we are fully ready over here. How many notes do I have right now? 207. Now those notes, for those of you who don't know, you can make more master books, uh, so you need 600. So I need the Master Farmer, I need the Master Hunter. I have mastered every other class of far, so that's awesome. So I could use, either use the notes for that, or you can go and you can use the notes for other stuff as well. Oh yeah, I forgot. We have two drops right next to each other and treasure maps. So if we can quickly go for this, that's going to be awesome. I'm thinking of going for this treasure map. Then we go for the drops. Or we can go for this treasure map. Then this one. We can quickly do the Lady Killer Demon Quest. Go for these maps over here in a row, and then go like that. Unfortunately, we play with loot respawn off, so the small tech is going to still be empty. Uh, you know what? I should probably do this. I do want to wrench on me if I need to wrench something in the future. That should probably be in between these two guns. Or right about there. You want to be able to set fire or, or out when you actually have it. Now, before we leave this place, I want to show you guys this. We have a ton of cement over here. And all four of these, we have 9,000 cement. The nice thing is this thing has nine slots. Normal advanced forges only have six. Boom, 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 boom. And then these over here have these. It's nice they don't have to smelt anything out or in. You just, if, if it's in your inventory in this mod, you just smelt it straight. And then when you want to pick stuff up, there's nothing you have to smelt out before you can pick the bench up. I love it. Okay, uh, over here we have our stuff crafting as well. I need a ton of stone. Uh, let's take a whole row of sand and a whole row of stone. I have no idea how much I'm going to make. I'm going to put 10k each. You guys can see we have a ton of stuff just crafting over here. Oh, so when I want to start my new horde base now, we can. I want to go and immediately make myself a ton of uh, blocks, concrete blocks. The more concrete blocks we have right now, the bigger we can make this base. Okay, uh, let's see. I'm going to put 10k in this one. Oh, wait, you can't. You have to put... 9999 nine, 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 and one more that's 10k i'm gonna copy this mix paste mix wait that's just one yeah that's just 1k 
it seems I have to copy the four nines, paste, and then do that. That's annoying, actually. Okay, and do this. We're we'll able to put another one in. Guys, this is a ton of resources. Look at this. And we still have some cement left. Okay, so we're going to need even more sand and stone. Let's see how much more I can make. <laughs> Another 10k. Um, let's make 2.5 in each. I want to make sure that all of them are crafting the same amount and the same speed. So they can all finish more or less the same progress. We don't want a ton of concrete mix stuck in one cement mix and then later worry about that. Okay, and then about 1,000 each. 1,000, copy... 1,000, 1,000, and 998. Boom. So we have a ton of concrete mix just crafting over here. What I'm going to do for now is we're going to put the sand and stone away. And I think with all this concrete mix, because we still have some concrete mix over here under building. Yeah, we have this much over here, and we're crafting more. Oh, I have some cement over here. Let me just quickly do this. Boom. Since he has two less, you can just do a little bit more. Yeah, but yeah, um, with all the concrete I have on me, I want to go and make some shapes. So we're just going to use these. I made myself some titanium electric fence posts. They are way more durable, if I'm not mistaken. And I don't know if they're just more durable or also do more damage. I am not sure. Do I have any other electric fence posts over here? No. If I had one crappy one, I could actually test, because this one says it has 1,000 hit points. I think the other one only has like 100 or something, right? Or 200 or something. Okay, anyways, uh, let's see. I'm going to put them under bowling for now. And then over here, I'm just going to make a ton of concrete blocks. Concrete shapes. Oh, 1,800 blocks. Boom. Concrete shapes. There you go. So the rest of those we can put away. And then we can quickly go do these quests on the map. Probably eat and drink before we go. Make sure we are all the way full. I am actually thinking of keeping the orange juice on me. Because especially when you're facing off against demons. Um, when, you, when, they, when they hit you with their fire, it does take away a lot of your- Oh, that's too much food. Damn, that was a waste. Um, it does take a lot of, of, of water away from you. So if you have a ton of proper drink on you, that's not going to be a problem. I'm not going to go to the wasteland right now. Although, when I get close to Lady Kill, I might accidentally get radiated. So I need to be careful of that. So first things first, we are going to drive- I wonder if we should go for the drops first. But we can just all go like this, right? Yeah, we're going to go for the Coles map first. I don't think there's any other maps over here, and that's on the bottom right corner over here. So we're going to go for that map first. We're going to make sure we are wearing the right glasses until we get to our demon quest. And then I want to make sure that my drone and my bike all have some space on them. I need to make this farm as well. Uh, I think when we get back, I need to start a farm. Oh, from that I thought it was a streamer coming. My forges are done, so there shouldn't be any problem right now. But yeah, uh, we need to go for the squares quickly, so I'm going to cut away the drive and see you guys there. Okay, so I should probably have seen if I can't make myself like a gyrocopter or something, because that was a ton of hills that I just had to run over. I could have probably driven around, but I wasn't sure how wide this thing was going to be. The so next up, we have to go for that treasure, but I'm actually thinking of going up first and then turning. You be careful of zombies falling into this hole of ours now. Uh, ring right glasses. Let's do this. Got to open it up. I need to be careful. I didn't place any block behind me. I should have actually. So they're all just gonna chill and pull in a beer with us. Hello. I dug through stone over here, so we're pretty deep down. Nice. Okay, automatic shotgun. I want to see if I can't make myself level 80. Oh, I should wait until she was out the hole. Now I'm going to have to struggle. Oh, wait. I was... I almost felt like I was able to double jump just now. Oh, that was weird. Okay. Um, I also realized I don't have my shotgun shells with me. I thought I would grab some shotgun shells, but I have the shotgun on me and no shell. So that's just a waste of space right now. But yeah, I, I, since we have a ton of steel right now, before we make a horde base, I want to see if we can't make like the buggy or something off-road that works better than this vehicle. Or just something with a ton of storage. We need a lot of storage right now. What is this place? This is just a military camp, right? Wait, what is this place? It looks kind of familiar. I wonder if I shouldn't just quickly really check out. There might be some demons though, so I need to be careful. 
Oh, you're just tough. I know there is a few demons over here. Okay, now I need to be careful. Oh crap. Oh no, 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 Run, 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 John, run, 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 run. I have a broken leg. Oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. My broken leg, my broken leg, my broken leg. Drive, 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 drive. Oh, that was a mistake. I could have probably gotten out there better, but I just made a big mistake. New to a soldier. You be careful of those demons. For some reason, I just couldn't move right now. I was struggling like crazy to move. Oh crap, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Yeah, I'm wasting laser tech right now, but I did a dumb dumb. Now that you're not healing anymore. Oh crap. My leg. I'm so slow right now. My leg. Why are there so many demolishers here? Okay, if I break their legs, it seems to. Help me out a ton. I need to be careful not to accidentally. Ooh. Ooh. I should be able to go back to the camp now and loot it, but I need something to heal my leg. I'm just glad it's not a giant demolisher. I think those dudes are a lot faster and tougher. Nice. Are you another demon? Mutated. You're just mutated. Okay, cool. Oh, crap. My, oh, Ooh, my aim sucks. My aim for some reason really sucks. But yeah, guys, by the time we get back to the base, the splint is going to take forever to heal. Uh, let's just quickly loot over here and see if we can't find some good stuff. I mean, after all we just went through, I deserve to get this loot. I was just an idiot just I, I should have been really careful. When I heard the first zombie, I need to be careful more. But I was uncareful and... Now I could be dying if I'm not careful. And every time I jump, my leg uh, pain gets extended by like four hours. Oh, please tell me you have some healing for me. Okay, first I can. Not bad, not bad. I need a splint though. I can't believe I did something that dumb just now. When I saw the demonic zombies, I should have fallen back a bit. You know what? I should actually keep splints on the drone as well. That just makes sense, right? Having something that can really help. Damn. This is going to be a real pain. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep going for the treasure maps. I'm actually thinking of keep stopping at a trader and see if they don't add some splints to me. Because that might just come in handy right about now. So we're going to go this direction. Yeah, hopefully the trader has some splints to me. At least I'll be able to run around without having to worry about the leg getting worse and worse and worse. But when they took out the stuff underneath me just now, that was really clever. I, I, I actually thought, oh wow, we are standing on cloth. If they break the cloth, I'm screwed. And then voila, they break the block right underneath me. Okay, I'm going to have to uh, dig myself out of here because I can't afford to jump out of here. Oh, is that all? After all that effort just now. Be careful of zombies pulling my head though. Come on, come on. Oh, why did I jump? Why did I jump? Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to first stop uh, this trader quickly before we go for the other quest. I don't think we're gonna be able to kill the do the lady kill quest right now, the demonic one. Because uh yeah, with our leg like this, we can't even run at full speed. And if we have to run away from demonic zombies, that's gonna be a nightmare. Okay, please tell me one of you guys have a splint. Be careful of zombies in here because there's holes in the walls. Sometimes there's zombies just chilling over here. Okay, if there's one person that's going to have some... Okay, we first need to probably sell stuff to the trader. But if there's one person that's going to have the splint, it should be her. Um, I just really hope she actually has one. If you guys see how slow I'm moving right now, this is annoying. You um, cheap son of a bitch. You cheap son of a... Okay, uh, sell this. I could sell other stuff. Yeah, let's sell it. Sell, sell, sell. This sells for 135. If I repair them, they sell for way more. 
problem is repair kits are expensive okay healing 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 let's see mods no healing or just a sewing kit wait what do you need to make the past again cost past the cost oh you need a campfire um please tell me she has one otherwise i'm gonna have to quickly first go back to the base we can't move without being able to just move it sounds weird saying it that way but i need to be able to move easier if i just move a little bit slower i injure myself severely how may i serve you please 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 yes 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 you're welcome okay thank you very much thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you okay so i'm just gonna scrap more we don't really need iron so i don't have to scrap them i could sell the stuff now the problem is gonna be how long it takes to heal if you continuously jump and move around or just run for that matter it's gonna take way longer to heal so i need to walk as much as possible or at least now we have the vehicle over here drive as much as possible so there's that lady killer quest over there See, there's a map over there as well i think let's go for this treasure map first and then head on back so i'm gonna just get away guys i'm gonna walk to my bike drive all the way there and hopefully by the time we've done all the dead quests um the leg will be healed i just really hope we don't come across a wandering horde in the meantime because trying to outrun a wandering horde with this kind of leg i don't think it's gonna be possible actually i hope it's possible to come across another small bunker although i don't know if it is another one because otherwise we're gonna have to do the eve quest again to get that bunker reset but if there's another bunker then that problem doesn't matter come on fall down here fall down i need you to crawl to me as well so your corpse doesn't get in the way yep come on there you go come on there you go crawl to me i see if they're in the way over there i won't be able to place my frames but if i can do this trick them to come into me i can place my frame now without having, without having to worry but now more and more and more zombies are coming i'm just gonna have to dig out it seems i'm not gonna take chances and die just because i'm trying to trying something oh no 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 bike don't do that okay stand up oh i had to jump i had to jump that last bit you need to be careful there's so many bears and mountain lions over here every time i climb off the bike i'm like oh be careful see that's a small tech bunker there has to be more on the map right if we see a well bunker type deal or well in the middle of nowhere you know that's another bunker but like i said i'm not sure if this map actually has it this is darkest fools versions or the very small one the v small one um i have no idea how many big tech bunkers small tech bunkers and caitlin's are supposed to be on the map there's probably on the forums we, we should be able to figure it out if we go read the forums but also i don't want to have it too spoiled I enjoyed tips and tricks and stuff from you guys, but I mean, like, I, I want to be amazed or surprised when I come across it. I don't want to just know everything. Okay, now this is just awesome. This is epic. There's another bunker over here. For a moment, I thought it might be the same bunker, but when I checked on the map, our small tech bunker is over there. There's one there, there's one here. Oh, nice. Okay, so now I just have to go get some of those... I need a key card. I don't want to... I, I could break through another way, but by the time I get inside, they've destroyed all the loot. Nice. That actually is a very pleasant surprise. I was about to say, there has to be more... See, that's what I mean by not spoiling. If I just uh, pay attention to the map more, we come across another... small bunker. I just hope we haven't looted already and I've uh, confused the two with each other. That would suck. As you can see, I also have some titanium on me in case a wandering wall comes by and i need to stack up and we need to go this way see as soon as they make it so you can't see through blocks anymore when you're in a one by one like this it's gonna make it much harder oh i don't have the right glasses on it's gonna make it much 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 harder finding treasures then you actually have to gonna invest in the treasure skill and you won't know what's going on on top that's the scariest part for the moment we more or less know what's going on on top because I mean, you can see. Damn, I had to jump. At least you don't completely break your leg or something when you have to jump again. Oh crap! Oh, dire wolf. Way too many wolves and animals and stuff over here. Okay, uh, next treasure map is right over there. Let's go. 
But yeah, guys, I'm so glad we found the other small bunker now. Now I can get more titanium. And we can get some more laser energy uh, laser cells. What, what do you call it again? Energy cells. We can get way more energy cells. The problem, however, is since our game stages, guys, we are level 177. So off-camera mining gave me about 20 levels. And then the Horde Knight last episode gave me like 11 levels. Um, but yeah, so our game stage is incredibly high. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be surprised if we get way more behemoths and demons and stuff in these bases. So even the big tech bunker, when we go back there finally, it's going to be so much harder than the first time we were there. Okay, I'm just going to dig down right here. If zombies come for me, they come for me. At least I'm putting the frames on top of me again. Before my drone pits in, thank you. Maybe when the drone's above my head. Oh, it's on the other side of the road. That's messed up. I wouldn't mind a wandering horde coming past here right now. Because they're going to have to go through this tunnel just like me. And as long as I can put some titanium down, they might be clever enough to dig into the dirt, but usually they go for your blocks instead of the dirt. Because the zombies are a little bit dumb when it comes to that. Damn, on the outskirts, in the middle of the road. Please, please, please. Uh, okay, that's not that bad. At least the silver and stuff sells for a lot of cash. And if you have Grandpa's awesome sores as well, that helps out even more. Okay, so that was that dig. There's a dig over here as well. Be careful of all these zombies who made. Also being able to jump in as they're falling in is a pain. Whoa, jump, 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 jump. Ooh, got stuck in that block just now. Man, I can't believe I had this many dig quests on the map. Also, one of these actually are double. Did I loot it already? One of the uh, dig quests that I actually had on the map, I had uh, like, was, was like the same map, and I read it too fast close to each other. Um, because basically, Darkest Fools, you can read the same treasure map name, like Steven. You can read two Steven maps. The problem is, um, if you read them too fast to each other, it's the same treasure. If you read them a little bit slower apart from each other, then you actually get to loot two different treasures. I need to come for these shotgun factories over here, or shotgun shops as well. But I just know there's going to be demons in here. But our game stage right now, there's no way there's not going to be any demons. Oh, it's part of a building. I should be able to dig down yet. Oh no, it's still trouble. Oh no, it's not. Place this block on top before my drone gets in. I just hate it when my drone just decides it wants to join. Oh, right here. Now getting out of here is gonna be a pain, especially if there's wandering ward. Nice, nice amount of cash. Okay. I need to get out of here now. Oh, it's nighttime, so remember when it's darkness falls, guys. When darkness falls, you get into trouble. Okay, where am I right now? Oh no, they started to break in the block already. I wanted to lift the block up so they could pull down. No, I can't. I could just try and destroy it, but I don't think my crowbar puts that far. Come on. There you go, I want them to fall in. As long as it's not a wandering ward right now, I'm safe. It would suck, because at the moment, I can't tell which is which. Imagine all of a sudden a titan just falls in here with us. Okay, now I just need to get out of here. I'm gonna have to do a lot of jumping, unfortunately. So my leg is gonna take a little bit of a punishment right now. Nice, it didn't actually really damage any further. All it did was stop the regen. Okay, we still have a level 5 clear over there, but I wanna go for these drops over here. Let's see... Okay, I'm gonna have to go around this place, aren't I? It's gonna be much easier just driving straight down and then to the left over here for the drops. It's weird how it works. If you go through town, there's so many walls and fences and stuff now, it's really just a lot easier driving around the city. Guys, I really hope these drops have some great loot in them. Remember, drops have the chance of giving you Master Books. So if we can get the Master Book for the two classes we still need, uh, that's gonna be awesome. And even if you get one that we already know, it's 90 skill notes that we get from scrapping those. So either way, we will score. Okay, I just hope we have enough space to grab both these drops right now. Because I just realized we are a little bit on the incumbent side. Come on, give me something good. Oh, come on. 
One more, one more, one more. Wait, where's your smoke gone? Now I'm close to it, all of a sudden the smoke's gone. And both just crap items. Damn. I was really, really look, uh, looking forward to being able to get some good loot from these. They just let me down considerably. Damn. Okay, so we need to go back to Anna and drop all our stuff off. I think I'm going to call the episode here, guys. Uh, if you guys like this episode, please like and share with your friends. Comment and tips of feedback down below. And if you guys are new to this channel, please remember to hit the subscribe button for more of this content. See you guys next time for some more Darkest Falls Insanity. A big thank you to all my members and patrons for your support. To join them in supporting the channel, please click join or the Patreon link in the description down below.